Hi there guys, it's Chris here with selfmynewbie.com and in this video I'm going to teach you how to automate or schedule airplane mode on your iPhone. So before we get into that, it really helps out the channel if you drop a like on this video, hit subscribe and turn on that bell if you want to be updated with new videos coming out like this all the time. So when I go to sleep, I like to actually listen to music, like some meditation sounds uh, before I go to sleep. But I also don't want my phone on all night next to my bed because of the EMFs and things like that. So what I want to happen is I want to listen to the music. So I want a connection. And then after 30 minutes, by the time I've gone to sleep, I want my phone to then turn off and go into airplane mode. So let's get into how to do that. So it's basically two steps. So the first thing you need to do on your iPhone is find this shortcuts uh, app, okay? Uh, when you go into that, at the bottom you have my shortcuts, automation and gallery. You wanna go to automation and you wanna go create personal automation. So what happens here is you'll have a bunch of triggers that will come up and the trigger that we want is do not disturb, okay? I know it says airplane mode here, but we wanna go to do not disturb. So EG, when do not disturb is turned on, something will happen. So this is our trigger. So when do not disturb is turned on, okay, you can do turned on or turned off. When it's turned on, hit next. Now we're gonna add an action. So we hit add action and you go to the search here and just start typing in airplane mode and it will come up there, set airplane mode. So I'm gonna hit that hit next. So this is my new automation. You can see when do not disturb is turned on, set airplane mode. Ask before running. No, we're not going to do that. Don't ask. Okay. Cause we don't want to, if we're going to fall asleep and have this happen, we don't want to have to like get up and confirm it. Right? So hit done and you'll see that your personal automation is complete. The next step is you want to go into settings and if you scroll down you have do not disturb here and you can turn on do not disturb or you and you can see when I turned on do not disturb my phone actually went into airplane mode okay so I'm just gonna go out of airplane mode what you want to do is schedule it okay so let's say for example you what you expect to sleep at like 10 o'clock. So let's say you go to bed at 9.30, you reckon you'll get to sleep at about 10 o'clock. Now you gotta be careful because when you start entering it in, your phone might switch to airplane mode. So you just keep turning it off. And then here we are, we're now scheduled uh, for 10 p.m. Okay, so at 10 p.m. this is what will happen. Your phone will go into do not disturb mode. That will trigger the automation which will then go into airplane mode. Okay, now at the beginning of the video, I told you uh, what I usually like to do, and you might be the same, is I like to play music, so I need my internet connection, and then I want it to turn off and go into airplane mode. Now, if you're playing music, you go to music, you play whatever tune you want to play, and then if you want the music to turn off, go to clock and go to timer. Okay, set your timer as well for like 30 minutes. Okay, so let's say I'm in bed now and it's 9.30. I expect to go to sleep at 10 o'clock. I know my phone is gonna switch off and go into airplane mode at 10 o'clock. So I can also schedule this down here. When timer ends, stop playing, okay? And you just set that up there. Okay, so I'd hit start, put my phone down. I'm gonna have an internet connection so that the music can play, but in half an hour, everything is gonna switch off. That way I can sleep and I don't have my phone's EMF, you know, around my head as I sleep. All right, guys, so that's how you do it. If you found value in this video, drop a like, subscribe. I'll see you on the next one. Take care.